I'm up in another attic uh, on another common call we get, which is truss repairs. These are often called out on home inspection reports and usually happen when at the time of construction. I want to just point out to you here that the truss members are normally fastened with gusset plates and they're done in the manufacturer. And all these little things are uh, kind of little nails that, that are pressed into the wood and they have a, a high capacity. Now when this joint is damaged, it's not um, correct to just repair it with a few nails and plywood as the case in this uh, in this truss. This um, is, is at the right thickness. They've got a uh, three-quarter inch uh, OSB on each side of that joint. However, I don't know if you can see this, but this particular member is only fastened with two nails. Uh, two small nails do not replace a full gusset plate like that. Um, and you definitely want to have a much bigger piece of plywood and I would say extending at least you know 24 inches past each side of the joint uh, and then properly fasten with you know 8D nails that uh, you know stagger to 2 inches on center something that has a much greater capacity on each side of that joint so again just another tip that you want to look out for and make sure that your contractor or whoever's repairing it is doing it correctly but I would uh, definitely recommend having an engineer out there and, and doing it properly